This is the theme assessment for English 8. Today you have three choices for which story you would like to use to answer the questions below. First choice of story is Thank You, Ma'am. You can read the story here or click here to listen. Second choice of story is The Path Through the Cemetery. Please click here to read it or click here to listen to it. Your third choice is your own book. You'll be able to look in your own book for textual evidence. Part 1. Identify, support, and explain two universal themes from the test. Part 1 is a summative. It is 100 points. Here is a list of some universal themes that we have talked about in class. Please feel free to use any of them to answer the text below. Please highlight which story you read. If I chose to read Thank You, Ma'am, I'm going to highlight it so my teacher knows what story I selected. Question 1. What is one possible theme in your text? Please place your answer here. Question 2. What evidence from the text supports this theme? Please place your answer here. Question 3. Explain how the evidence you selected supports your theme. Please enter your answer here. And question four, what is this moment showing us about the theme that you selected? In other words, what is a statement of theme for this moment? Please place your answer here. Question five, what is another possible theme in your text? Please type here. Question six, what evidence from the text supports this theme? Please type your answer here. Question seven, explain how the evidence you selected supports your theme. Please place your answer here. And question eight, what is this moment showing us about the second theme you selected? In other words, what is a statement of theme for this moment? Please type your answer here. Part two, write a paragraph in which you make a claim about a theme from the text that you chose. Provide supporting evidence for your claim and explain how your evident su evidence supports that claim. Please note, this part, part two, is a formative, so do your best. Your teachers want to see what you already know and what you are able to do. Please type your answer here. Don't forget to look at your rubric to understand how this assessment will be graded. 